Are you worried about what happens to your muscles when you stop exercising? Perhaps you've heard the common belief that muscle magically transforms into fat. Well, hold on tight, because today we're about to delve deep into the science behind this fitness myth. Hello and welcome to Spill Edge. Today, we're tackling a common misconception that's been circulating around the fitness world like a stubborn rumor. Does muscle really turn into fat when you stop exercising? Let's unravel the truth behind this misconception and find out what really happens to your body when you hit pause on your workouts. Like always, we've divided this video into three chapters. Chapter one, dispelling the myth. Chapter two, exercise and muscle maintenance. And chapter three, the calorie problem. We'll begin with chapter one, dispelling the myth. First things first, let's address the fundamental misconception here. The idea that muscle somehow transforms into fat when you stop exercising. It's a notion that seems to defy the laws of biology and for good reason. You see, muscles and fat are two entirely different tissues. It's like comparing apples with oranges, or in this case, biceps to love handles. Muscle tissue is dense, firm, and highly active. It's responsible for generating the power and strength that allow us to move, lift, and perform various physical activities. On the other hand, fat tissue is, well, squishy and less metabolically demanding. Its primary role is to store energy and to provide insulation and cushioning for our organs. So the idea that muscle could somehow transform into fat is like saying that an apple could magically morph into an orange. It just doesn't happen in the realm of biology. When you stop exercising, your muscles lose mass and strength due to disuse. However, this does not mean that muscle cells are converting into fat cells. Instead, what often occurs is a shift in body composition. Without regular exercise to maintain muscle mass and a balanced diet to support overall health, you may experience an increase in body fat percentage. This can create the illusion that muscle is turning into fat. Moving on to chapter two, exercise and muscle maintenance. When you exercise regularly, you're giving your muscles a tough time at the gym. They get stronger and bigger, which helps your body burn calories faster. It's kind of like having a super efficient engine that keeps your metabolism running smoothly. But when you hit the pause button on your workouts, your muscles don't need to work as hard anymore. And they might start to shrink because they're not getting the same amount of activity. It's kind of like they're saying, Hey boss, we've been working hard, but now we can take a break. Okay. So they relax and get smaller until you start exercising again and give them a reason to grow strong and active once more. Now we move to the final chapter, the calorie problem. Now let's talk about what happens when you take a break from pumping iron or going for those runs. You see, when you're not exercising as much, your body doesn't need as much energy, so your calorie needs may go down. It's like a body is saying, hey, we're not moving as much, so we don't need as much fuel. But here's the thing, if you keep eating the same amount of food as before without adjusting for the change, those extra calories can pile up. And guess what happens to those extra calories? They don't just disappear. Instead, they get stored in your body as fat. Therefore, it's important to listen to your body and adjust your food intake accordingly when you're not as active. That way, you can avoid those extra calories turning into unwanted fat deposits and keep your body feeling healthy and balanced. So the next time you hear someone claim that muscle can magically transform into fat, remember the science behind it. It's not a case of alchemy or mysticism, but rather a basic misunderstanding of biology. By staying informed and educated, you can separate fact from fiction and make informed decisions about your fitness journey. Thanks for tuning in, folks. Don't forget to like, share, and subscribe for more myth-busting content. Until next time, bye-bye.